focusing. Just give me all your attention. Give me all your attention. Hi. Here we are at my office tour. So I appreciate your guys' patience. I was waiting for some shelves to come in and it took a really long time and I really wanted to have them together for the office tour. So for the office, I worked with C and We, like yes and yes in Italian and French. They are this really cool kind of boutique interior design firm. And basically what you do is you choose a room that you want them to redo. You take photos and measurements and send it over to them. And then they will put together a layout and kind of like a mood board of a few different ideas and then you choose one and then basically they organize everything they choose the furniture they order it etc etc they come in and it basically takes them like half a day to a day and they completely redo your room they paint it they put together all the furniture they do all the accessories and they put everything up like they put up all these photos which i was really happy about because I'm not very good at that. So I will insert some before photos here, just so that you can see what it looked like, but it was kind of like a grayish color and just didn't really have a lot of brightness. I think that the white works much better. It was after we moved in, so there was stuff everywhere, but it wasn't organized. I had the desk originally where the clothing rack is and I love how Lindsay and her team changed the layout of the office. It didn't have any curtains and I'm surprised at how much of a difference that makes. It like feels a lot more finished. So we obviously changed the desk. The desk makes a huge difference. Changed the shelving, like split them up. I feel like we really made good use of the like shoe rack corner because it's this awkward little space. They did an amazing job and I'm so happy with the layout. The way that they changed the layout of my office, I really feel like changed the whole vibe of the office and made it feel so much bigger. I will have all their info in the description box below as well as all the links to the pieces and the products that you see in the office as much as I can. Here we go. So you walk in. There's this beautiful desk from CB2. I love this desk. It's actually really big, but somehow it doesn't seem too big for the space. Got a beautiful and very comfortable chair, I have to say. Then they did this wall, which I love so much. You may remember from my old office, these three were mine originally, and I'm super picky about art, but Lindsay chose this to go in the middle to do like a little gallery wall and I am so thrilled with it. I think it looks beautiful. I love the photo. It's like kind of inspiring and a little bit whimsical. And then over here we've got my clothing rack. That is from Ikea. And these two shelves are also from Ikea as well. My bags up here, lots of makeup. There's my Chanel bag. Some more makeup. Similar thing on this side. I really wanted to have my makeup out as much as I could just because I feel like if you put it away, you forget what you have and you won't use it. And I'm really trying to use as much as I can, like shopping my own stash without going and buying a ton of makeup all the time. Little plastic kind of holders. I got everything off Amazon. Here's my little windowsill. Got my jewelry. This cute little vase. This is from Common Goods. They're a Toronto-based, I guess, pottery company? Pottery brand? They make all their stuff handmade and it's really beautiful. We've got some white drapes. Drapes? Curtains? I don't know. Full-length mirror here. So I can see myself. And maybe do some videos in here. And then finally... I'm really proud of this little corner because I actually found these myself and put them together. <laughs> I put all of it together. So got some space for my shoes. I had a really hard time finding shoe shelves that actually had shelves large enough to fit like heels and not like children's shoes. <laughs> Anyways, I found two 
shelves from closet made so they're the eight cube shelves and then i just put this one on top it's a little bit short but i don't really care i just wanted something else up here and then i guess i could put something up there i'm really happy with how everything turned out got some vases these are some books and then this is my png you can't really see it best beauty social media content got a gorgeous prada book and then some sunglasses in there i actually don't know where this is from to be honest sorry this is another common goods vase this is from pier one this is from solutions and then in here is a bit more closet space but it's not like super well maintained. Well, it's not bad actually. That's my office. I love it so much and I would highly recommend Lindsay and her team at C and We. That's it. I don't I don't have anything else to tell you, I don't think. I also have a full home tour. I will link that for you guys in case you're interested. Andrew's in that one, which is kind of fun. He's hilarious. He's way funnier than me. He thinks I'm funny and that's why I married him, so. This is just me blabbing on. I don't know what else to say. I am tanned right now because I had a spray tan. I have a shoot coming up at the end of the week and I went to see Jen of Beloved Tan in Toronto. She's the only person I go to for a spray tan. She does an amazing job. There's never any streaks, never any like weird color around your wrist or your ankles or anything. I've gone to her before photo shoots and I know that it doesn't show up streaky or anything in the photos, which can be an issue. Thanks for watching. Bye. <laughs>